Hi there, this is Munaw once again and welcome to the 10th episode of Cool New Apps where all the applications are just one month old and do something out of the box. Like always, all the download links will be in the description of this video. And before we get started, I would like to thank our sponsor, TV Times. So usually, I have to google the release date of my favorite TV shows like House of Cards, Game of Thrones and Silicon Valley etc. And sometimes I often miss them, but with TV Time, I can track all of them in one single application. So here is how it works. When you first install this application, you have to add all your TV shows that you're currently watching. And based on that, this application will give you a timetable of all the upcoming TV shows. And another cool feature is, once you are done watching your favorite TV show, like let's say Silicon Valley, then you can also see the reactions of other user, like memes and GIF etc. So yeah, check out TV Time. And while you are at it, also follow me there. I'm going to use this application for quite a long time. And with that being said, let's get started. So some of you might already know, Google is working on its secret mobile operating system called Fuchsia. And if you like to see what's coming next, then you should try this application, Almerdino. Now it's not an actual operating system, but the glimpse of what's coming next. So the home screen is like a vertical scrolling list of placeholders, kind of like how we see in the recent application. And in the center, you will see a profile picture. Once you tap on that, you will see date, city name, battery and badness etc. Overall, it's quite early to say anything at this moment. It might be a new operating system or forgotten like or code, only time will tell. Now you may be wondering, what is this? There is already a Firefox browser. And well, this particular one focuses more on privacy. Now this application is still in development, but shout out to folks over Gadget Hack for compiling the APK from the GitHub page. So this application is a full-time private browser. You open it, browse your stuff and then delete it. The moment you close this application, everything is gone. But Minal, why would I use yet another browser when I can simply open incognito window on Chrome? Well, it's a good question and the reason is, one, you will see a lot less ads and pop-up while using this browser compared to Chrome and second, it will block all the trackers from the ads, analytics and social. Now this is not a new application, but the idea is unique and they have recently gone free. So studies have found out that the most productive people work for 52 minutes straight followed by 17 minute break. So simply click on the start button and the timer will count to 52 minutes followed by a 17 minutes break. Earlier this application was paid but they recently gone free. So yeah, check that out. Bricky helps you to read your curated newsletter from one application but without giving out your email addresses. So here is how it works. You open this application and subscribe to your favorite newsletter and then it will appear in your inbox. It doesn't need any sign up, permission and yes, there are no ads. And yeah, this application is still unreleased and they still don't have all the newsletter from not so big media houses. But don't worry, you can always suggest that from within the app. As the name suggests, it is a simple sleep tracking application which calculates how much did you sleep and keeps a log of it. But what is so special about this application is it is completely automated. You simply have to install this application, give it all the permission and forget it. It will automatically work in the background without sucking any battery life. And in the past one week of testing, it has worked flawlessly for me. Now don't go by the stats, I had a pretty messed up schedule. But anyways, if you are looking for a sleep tracker, definitely give this one a try. For all the students out there, Socrative will help you with your homework. Simply take a photo of your worksheet, it can be a science, math, philosophy, history, anything. Just snap a picture and it will give you a bunch of curated answers from sites like Yahoo, Khan Academy, Crash Course, Wikipedia, Quora and Google etc. But why just not use Google Assistant or something? Well for one, not everyone can use voice search everywhere, especially in classrooms. And second, after testing this application several times, I did see when it comes to academic questions, this one is pretty better than Google Assistant. So imagine this, you're collecting evidence for some sort of crime by taking pictures and recording video. But then an aggressive person snatch your phone from you and delete all the recordings or maybe break down your phone. And now I know that sound bad, but you will also lose all the potential evidence, right? And this is where this application comes in. So what it does is, it records your location, audio, video, pictures, everything and then simultaneously upload them to the cloud storage. So even if somebody takes your phone, your backup will still be there. And the cool thing is, it also works when the screen is off. Though this application gave me some hiccups, but the idea is 10 on 10. So next time you find yourself in situation like United Airlines, remember, there's an app for that. Well, this is all for now. For all those who were asking me to upgrade my phone, well, we finally have Google Pixel in the house. So yeah, thumbs up for that. So let me know in the comment section below if you like me to make videos on things you can do on your new smartphone or stuff like that. 
सो या दैट्स पीडी मच इट आई विल सी इन द नेक्स्ट वीडियो एंड गेस लाइक ऑलवेज थैंक यू फॉर वॉचिंग